Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Shalini in France and today I have the pleasure to speak to you about an art fair that I had participated in a few days ago in a city that's very close to Paris so it's on the suburbs of Paris, on the western suburbs and this is a very well known and a big city called Saint-Germain-en-Laye and this particular city really celebrates art, culture, music and I say this with my own experience of having participated in the local art fair there for two years. So the first one was in 2018 and the next one is now a few days ago. So this is our work table and we are preparing everything that we need for the art fair tomorrow. Our things that we would need Definitely these are my stands for the art and that's the bed sheet I will need and we are going to carry this table for the art fair tomorrow. My postcard stand. So this is something that I bought recently and I'm very happy because I've always had these postcards but I could never display them very well and now that I have this it's going to be so much easier for me to display them. Straighten this. So I'm so happy with the way how it looks. Are you ready for the big day? Absolutely, I'm so proud of you. The goal is to uh, at least show what you're doing. Yeah. This is the most important for an artist. These are also some sweets that I'm going to be using on my table as part of the exhibition. Oh, now she's going crazy again. Hmm? What is, what are you doing, you silly girl? So now the table has been emptied and we are ready to put this in the car. Allez. I have to uh, hurry for work, Shalini. I'm leaving in 30 minutes. By the way, let me introduce myself. My name is Shalini and I've been living in the Paris region since uh, 11 years now. And I love to make videos of my life here in France. I love French recipes. I love the French way of life. So I try to show as much of it through my videos. I hope that you are going to subscribe to my channel. Please do join me on Instagram because I'm very active on this platform. And the seats have been pulled down to make space. And with my husband's help, we have just fitted in the table. No, no. So we have put cushions behind. I did it. It's not with your husband's help. <laughs> so he did a lot of the work, I agree. Uh, so we are putting in the chair over here. And this is our table right here. So this is going to be my display table for tomorrow. If I haven't explained this before, unfortunately not all of the artists will be lucky to receive a table. So most of the artists, they have to go with all of their supplies themselves. So this is the reason why I take my table with me. Oh, it's a beautiful day today and I truly hope that we are going to have a day like this tomorrow. It's sunny and there's a little bit of wind as well. It's not too hot. So in French, an art fair is called Marché Da. This is usually an opportunity not only to showcase your work to customers, but also a great moment to network with other artists and to also be able to have the experience of setting up a stall. If you are an artist yourself and you plan to, to participate in art fairs and have exhibitions, I would just like to let you know that you would first need to have a special status called the auto entrepreneur status that you need to apply for in in order for you to be able to legally sell your work uh, because every form of income that you have in France it has to be declared so this is a very long process and maybe I'm going to speak about it in another video please let me know in the comments if this is something that you would really like to know I would be happy to make a video it can be a bit complicated for for the non French to understand how to go about in this system anyway so I've had my auto entrepreneur status since the past uh, six seven years and as a result this has allowed me to participate in many many art fairs and it was difficult for me to juggle standing at my stall and speaking to the uh, speaking to the customers and also to make a video at the same time but I've tried my best to show you what this art fair looks like for this particular art fair I'm quite happy myself with everything that I've covered so so please enjoy the video hello and good morning it's that time of the year when I gather all of my paper cuts together and I'm ready to exhibit it. I have thankfully slept enough. 
uh, because there's usually a lot of last minute things that I have to remember and I'm just going to show you. So here's all of my artwork that's packed in here. There are a total of about 15 frames that I'm going to put up. First thing I'm going to do is put my bag in and then I'm free. Here comes my work, all of my art. If I haven't mentioned the time, it's it's 7 o'clock in the morning now and we are supposed to be there at 7.30. Unfortunately, we are late. Mackie, did you know you're supposed to be home? Hmm? My husband has lovingly prepared for me this toast that I'm going to hurriedly eat now. Mackie, do you know that you have to be inside? Going to the toilet won't be so easy today. I'm not even sure that there's any toilet for us. So we really have to go to the restaurants and use the toilets over there. So we have the GPS set and it's 34 kilometers that we should hopefully cover in 32 minutes. And uh, being a Saturday, we're not going to have a lot of traffic on the roads. I have up till 9.30 to fix up my stand and that's why I'm not really very nervous. Also because this is something that I have done quite a few times before. I pretty much know how, I'm, how my stand is going to look like, the things I need. So I know that I can do it fast. So we have just entered the city Saint Germain en Laye, going straight for 900 meters, not even one kilometer, and we're going to reach our spot. So this is going to be my space over here. I've already got a table. So I just need to put now the top all around it. So now we have to slowly, slowly get out everything. So we've managed to get, so this is the tarp and this is the first part that we have managed to get over here. We still need to attach over here. So this is really very helpful. So I really wonder if many other people are thinking of using the same thing. That's it. Good job. So we're going to be using now these chains to hang up my frames. This is my favorite work that I'm going to uncover first. Ta -da! So, all right. Yeah, so just remove that hook here and you put it here if you want. Right? You can adjust. It's matching your jacket. That's the best you can do, Shalini. Yeah? It will be like that. Yes. So I have a nice boulangerie to look at over there. You can see there's a sculpture over here. I'm going to look at his work later. It looks very nice. Finally, your hotel management comes. Wind. But it's drizzling a little bit, so I really hope that it's going to stop soon because once uh -huh. it stops drizzling, there's going to be lots more people coming in. But anyway, it's it's early. It's not even nine o'clock in the morning, so we can't expect a lot of people coming by now. So this is uh, what did you take here once again? Un rouleau cinéma. So it's c'est comme une c'est comme un pain au raisin avec du cinéma par dessus. I got it from that boulangerie right behind you. So with the first sale, I got myself a bread for breakfast. Really good. already been a lot of people coming in so I need to think of what I can do to make my stand a little bit more unique so this is why I've got along with me an example of my work that I do
where in Saint-Germain-en-Laye there is usually a very impressive round of artists who showcase their work. I'm speaking about artists, painters, sculptors. So there are no, uh, so there are no jewelry makers or bag sellers. So nothing to do with cosmetics uh, or accessories. This is really art for the home. Alors c'est tout, euh, tout de la récupération, je, je ramasse tout ce que je trouve en métal et je transforme derrière, j'assemble, euh, je soude à l'arc et je découpe au plasma pour faire euh, toutes sortes de, de silhouettes qui, euh, voilà, qui sortent de mon, de mon imagination. D'accord, et est-ce que c'est euh, la première fois que vous êtes ici dans le marché d'art ou vous avez exposé même avant Non, non, j'ai déjà, c'est au moins la 4 ou 5 e fois que je suis ici à à Saint-Germain. Okay, merci beaucoup. Merci. Ça que j'aime le plus, c'est ça. C'est très joli pour moi. stall is just next to mine. He uses a uh, lino gravure. So let's have a look. So this is my stall over here. Yeah. She's a Japanese artist. postcard uh, business account so it's got her name right here it's Luka Sukeno and behind her postcard I really like this where you can uh, scan to have uh, direct access to her Instagram account oh. yes it's I'm really I'm really very happy because I feel that uh, as an artist I'm receiving a lot of encouragement and support. We are getting to interact with them and we have met already so many different kinds of people. So yeah, this is the part that's really very nice. Unfortunately, I, we can't video when we are both of us very busy with uh, talking to our uh, customers over here. But what else can I say? It's been such a pleasant uh, and it's really amazing because uh, I am the only Indian artist in this whole art fair and every time a customer comes in here and then they recognize me to be an Indian so they want to talk to me about their travels to India so that's also a very interesting exchange I get to meet uh, so many French who love elephants and they go to India to, to meet elephants and uh, what other strange things have you come across? This nice. What is it called again? Financier. Oh, a financier. So I'm going to have this. It's homemade um, chocolate paste. Yum. I'm going to have a nice bite. Mmm. <laughs> for me to wrap up and I'm going to close down my shop now. It's been a wonderful day. So here's my stall. It's the end of the day. Everything's being removed and well I find it a bit ironic that the sun is finally coming out now. So my neighbor artists have all gone. My name's been removed. The organization has been very efficient and now we just need to remove the, the table cover, take our things and go home. We're done. So it's been a wonderful day. I have spent 10 hours at the art fair. Uh, it has even been a better experience than the art fair 
that we've had here in 2019. A very big thank you to this beautiful city of Saint-Germain-en-Laye and there's always a lot of curiosity, a lot of interest and uh, very honestly if it, if it isn't for people like them uh, I think that artists would really be struggling and they wouldn't uh, they wouldn't have the support. Pierre, how was the experience for you? Fun. Yeah, it was fun, no? Yeah, cool. Because not just for me, uh, it's a great opportunity for him too to <coughs> chat. There's a lot of chatty people. They all want to come and they want to have a good chat. I hope that you have enjoyed my video. I've tried to give some tips wherever I could. I look forward to seeing you in my next video. See you. Bye-bye.